Hi there, Cameron McCormick here. I'm in front of our Pro 2 widescreen by Full Swing Golf at the Lucy Davies Golf Academy in California. And I have the tip for you to start hitting your driver further down the fairway. And it all, it's all centered around hitting him right out of the center of the club face. We can swing with all our might and make this club head move really, really fast. But what's gonna happen is if we strike it off the toe of the heel, the bottom of the face, or the top of the face, the ball's not gonna fly as far as it otherwise would. And that drill for you is called laneway. Here's how it works. We set up two head covers on the ground slightly wider than the width of your driver. You begin by making small practice swings, moving that club visually through that space, akin to driving a car on the road uh, with the lanes delineated by those white lines. It serves a purpose to tell us where versus where not to drive. Well, the head cover is doing the same thing in this place. And clearly there's a range of maladies that exist as I continue to work on my laneway right here that would cause someone to not land their club correctly in this laneway, but rather the highest of mileage plays that I have is a skill like this or a drill like this that just works on that coordinative function of returning your club to the exact point where that golf ball is sitting. So I've made a few slow swings. Now I'm gonna put a T right in the middle of the head covers. I'm gonna to start to speed that swing up. I'm gonna strike the top of that T without the ball there. So we're still in dry fire or practice mode. Okay, T launched out there just like it's a golf ball. And now we're ready to advance to a golf ball. Again, we're working on centers of contact to maximize your value for the speed that you deliver to the ball to send that ball way down the fairway. Yep, for sure, right out of the center of the club face. Full swing simulator picks it up immediately. There's no latency. It's just like we're out there playing golf. And sure enough, what's gonna happen here is it's gonna display that ball speed of 153 miles an hour which for me is what I look for that tells me I hit it right out of the center of the club face. So it's one thing to understand what to do. It's another thing to understand how that should play out and actually be able to give us feedback. And that's the beauty of technology. Technology provides us feedback that tells us whether we are improving or not. So it becomes like this flashlight that illuminates the pathway for us. And that's how we use technology in coaching to elevate your standard of performance. So you at home can coach yourself using your full swing golf simulator and advance your drives further down the fairway.